Can you make French fries with a potato, an air cannon, and a tennis racket? Odds of this working, first try. 10 out of 10, no doubt. So this video is gonna be 30 seconds long. 45 at max. Okay. Not a problem. Okay. Launch it. Ready? Yep. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, it just vaporized right through it. Here's all of our french fries. They're right there. <laughs> That's potato, all right. Do we need to tone down the pressure? I think we need to turn it down a bit. <laughs> so that was a decent sized potato that we had in there. Yeah, this is all like these little fragments. That's all that we can find of that potato that's left, which means the rest of it is like aerosol. We are breathing it up. We, we just each ate half a potato, I think. Does Lunch. It, does, it, does it feel like that? It does not. So that first shot we were at 175 up there. We have now dropped it 75 PSI. I still think this is gonna be too hard, but we'll see. Attempt two, ready when you are. Three, two, one. Ah, dang it. Breathe it in, hurry, breathe it in. Potato bake. Oh yeah. I found. Got a little bit of skin and uh, the particles are about the same, just more of them. Okay, let's drop it down to 60. Yeah. First of all, we did not think this racket was going to last more than one shot, so props to tennis rackets. Uh, after looking at the high speed of that second one, we had some cube shapes coming out of the back and then they vaporized when they hit the um, the board. So we're gonna hook up a net to try and catch everything after it passes through the tennis racket. And we did drop it down to 75 PSI as well. So we'll see if that works. Okay, the fry catching net has been installed. Okay, attempt three, ready when you are. God dang it. <laughs> I think we need a new laundry bag. <laughs> Just <laughs> we did catch some though. Yep, that's potato. Just, just needs to be fried now. I think we're moving in the right direction. Ash browns. <laughs> that bag did not work though. Wait, wait, wait. I think that's a French fry. Holy cow. We've Caught got one net. French fry. So what do we drop it down to? 50 PSI? 40? 40? <laughs> Maybe 40? This one is foolproof. It's gonna work. I know it. Okay, attempt four. Oh. I was feeling that one. Did we catch anything? Oh yeah. <laughs> Hash browns. It's more cubed. It is cubed. <laughs> How did that happen? <laughs> Watch that in slow mode. <laughs> I don't know. They're like almost like perfectly cute. <laughs> Most of them are little cubes like that, but I think it, the potatoes hitting the long way, so they should be longer. Yeah, okay, 25 psi. I'm feeling this one. Is it aimed? Yes. Ready? Yep. Hey. That's a good sign. I think that's like the the minimum. Uh, they're a little longer. Yeah, those will work. 
I mean, I know there are some restaurants that would pass those off as fries, so I think that's a win. I think we're one of those. <laughs> I mean, you might as well blast 10, that's quick. Yeah, oh yeah. Like that, that is better, that's better looking than I thought it was gonna be. I had a lot of faith. <laughs> Okay, that's how many we were able to get before our laundry bag was no longer functional. A little short. Okay. Well, never stop me. These are gonna pop a lot. And Mitchell got mozzarella sticks because he no longer has faith that these are gonna taste good. Well, I just wanted something to go with it. Oh, okay. Fries is like a side dish. To the mozzarella To my side dish. <laughs> More? Uh, I think so. <laughs> okay, they've been salted. They look decent, actually. Good. Is that something that you'd expect to get it? I don't know that at a restaurant. Really? Taste it down. You can watch me watch Dan eat. <laughs> mm. I think it's better than In-N-Out fries. For sure. Wow. I think we're onto something. Can you imagine that? A restaurant where you walk in and just like behind a wall of glass, they're just like shooting potatoes out of it. <laughs> <laughs> like you can watch them make your fries. That would be awesome. If you guys are interested in that, let us know. You gotta try one. Smells like fries. <laughs> oh geez. What restaurant would you say they're better than? Uh, they're, I don't know about a restaurant. They're a good, they're like, a good eight or nine. I mean, really? They're not bad. That might be some of the cooking, though. Extra fresh fries we made from the air cannon. Like an air fryer? No, uh, it's kind of like that. <laughs> yes, Is there sir? something wrong with them? No, we <laughs> look. Mitchell will eat one. That doesn't say much, but. <laughs> Good? As a self-proclaimed foodie, how would yeah. you rank these? Um, probably a nine. A nine? I would say a nine. Out of ten? Yeah, I think we're onto something. I would say it's good. I don't know if I should though. Hey, at the beginning of this video, you gave this, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Craig gave them an eight or a nine, and Jordan said they were a nine. I said ten out of ten. But, but you, was that was before taste. you tried them. This was taste. Ten yep. out of ten, I thought that it would work. <laughs> That's how you wash your hands. <laughs> please, please feed me one. You sticking with your 10 out of 10? I'm not doing a lot, that's 10 out of 10. I told you. They're not bad. Overall, I call this one a success. Thank you to Alex for the idea, and uh, you guys let us know if we should start our own restaurant. Or if you have any other ideas of what we should do, because we have nothing to do. <laughs> please tell us something to do. Obviously. <laughs>